What's up, my pilots? I'm your Poncho here, and we're back playing Morrowind. I went back to ask Sulamatul about where the caverns are. He says they lie to the south, southeast of the camp. A north facing door and a little hill, halfway between us and the slopes of Red Mountain. Go north from the camp to the water, then turn east. At a rock con on the beach. Turn and head straight south until you find the door. The spirits of our ancestors guard the caverns. They will attack, and they will kill you if they can. Force your way past them or evade them. Get the bow and return to prove your worthiness. Alright, I can handle that. So we go north from the camp until we hit the water. Then we go... Oh, hello. Oh, everyone's happy to see me now. Nice. I'm not even a tribe member yet. Go north from the camp until we hit the water, and then turn east and start looking for a cannon on the beach. Sounds good to me. Get out of here. Little Kwama Forager. Alrighty. So I guess I shouldn't start turning northeast just yet. We do want to go up until we find the water. There it is. All right. In the middle of a sandstorm right now, but whatever. We'll deal with it. Surely it's not this Karn. I mean, that must be it, I guess. It's a little bit weird to give us directions that tell us to go the wrong direction and then turn around. I don't know. I guess we'll be able to use our, our world map. Once we're southeast of the camp, we should run into it. I'm amazed. Hey, 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 hey. Freaking cliff racer. He's, flying. He's getting blown away by the wind. Alright, where are my spells? Yup. Alright. Now I'm supposed to head due south until I find it. I wonder if I should follow this ravine or not. Hmm. I guess we'll know if we went too far. He said midway between here and Red Mountain? That's, that's pretty far. Huh. I guess he said the slopes of Red Mountain, so it might be a little bit sooner than we're thinking. Who knows? Oh, hello, rat. Get out of here. Man, look at all the bubbling mud pits around here. Blip, 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 blip. Definitely a sign of volcanic activity. That actually makes great sense. Even in the real world. Getting some trauma roots. You can make friends back in the camp with these. Oh yeah. So we're looking for a, a nerp, north facing door in a hillside. Looks like we might be close. There's a hillside above us here. Or I may have gone right past it. It's totally possible. Hmm. It says south southeast of camp, so I need to turn back this way a little bit, I think. Woo, sliding. Careful. Ooh, hello. Wahaha. Dispose of corpse. Yeah, I'm not... Maybe I should just wait for a minute and kind of... Oh, here, let me just wait until I'm healed. I was hoping the sandstorm would subside. Oh, hello. Angry Gua. Man, he was, was he resisting my magic that whole time? That's weird. Man, I wish this sandstorm would go away. You just wait a little bit longer. I'm sure we would have been able to see the... Oh, jeez, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Wow. Wow. <laughs> That's something my brother says a lot when he gets upset at video games. He goes, wow! Yep, this is it. <laughs> well, I was right. Getting rid of the sandstorm definitely helped us find the damn place. <laughs> what are the odds, man? Ooh. Okay, so I know there's a lot of stuff going on in here. We're probably going to need to levitate at one point or another. What are you guys? Mummies. Just got bone meal and salts. Okay. They look like guardians. This could get nasty. I don't remember this area killing me a lot as a kid, but then again, 
I may just have forgotten. Oh, here's somebody. Let's see how tough he is. Throw a fireball at him. Why is that going out green? That's supposed to be a fireball. What the hell is this? Is he resisting my magic or something? Oh, that hit him. Got him. Dire spark arrow. Neat. Longbow. The rest of that's not worth much. I'm going to take frequent breaks here. Try and keep our health and magic up full. I sense that there's something above us here. I'd like to go up and look at that. Hello? Looks like a sort of a cross path in the cavern here. Let me get above the ground before I start fighting this guy. Hmm. I wonder. Wow, look at this. Creepy. Huh, who's this? Dead adventurer. Iron Flame Mauler. Chitin and steel. Strange combination. <laughs> One piece of gold. We'll take his lockpicks and probes. Everything else is just so much junk to me. There's all these skulls sitting here. It's a bit weird. Hmm. Okay. Let's go back across the little land bridge. Rocks sticking across. Is this the way we're meant to go, or...? Maybe I should put a little light down. Oh, I can't rest here? Yeah, I can rest here. <laughs> Good. I need my magicka back. Okay. Didn't I have a light that was on self? Yeah, I called it flashlight, didn't I? Yeah. Oh, I must be out of batteries. There we go. Now I can at least partially see what's going on here. Hey, Mr. Rat! Well, the rats aren't giving us much trouble anymore, are they? I think that last guy must have been resisting our magic or something. Because he... It looked like it was a green ball instead of a fireball. I don't know what that was. Hello. Another skeletal corpse. Some gold. Not a whole lot else. Alright, so I guess this area up here is just for some extra loot. We didn't seem to find much awesomeness, did we? I need to figure out how to hotkey things. That should be higher on our agenda than it is. Alright, let's drop down. Continue through the cave. Oh, I see you up there. close you need to get to use that bow, man. <laughs> missed me. It's pretty bad when his bow can't be effective at a range where my fireballs are. This flashlight thing is nice. It's going to start raising our illusion skill, which if you've forgotten is one of our minor skills. So it's good to have those going up. Hello. Big open room. I would have guessed there'd be an enemy or two in here, but, you know, if there ain't, it's fine with me. There's water down here. Oh, I fell. Plunk. Anything interesting down here under the surface? Doesn't seem to be. Let's swim back up. Try and keep it bright enough to see. Hmm. Do I need to levitate to get to this, or can I just jump from over there? I feel like I could just jump. Save my magicka, you know? There we go. The Karma Burial. So this is apparently a multi-area dungeon. Oh, well you got me. Bugga! And you're dead. 
They all have enchanted arrows. I'm gonna get some serious bucks for those when we finally get out of here and I can sell them. Oh, that was weird lighting. Super strange lighting bugs. I think that the flashlight, the light spell may not be playing nicely with one of the lighting mods or something. Oh, again. Fireball defeats arrows. Look at how freaking dark it is in here without the light. Man, I'm glad we have that spell. I'm going to be carrying a lot of arrows by the end of this. Hello. More corpses. Just got salts and bone meal, which is fine. It's potion ingredients. We'll take it. Oh, great. Another one of these. Hup! Hup! Oh, and I fell in the water. Great. Let's start over. <laughs> Go back to the start. Hup! Hup! Dang it! I'm going to levitate balls to this. Alright, ooh, it's creepy in here, man. Alright, there's a dead adventurer over here, it looks like. Let's go see what he's up to. What you got for me? Frostbite War Axe? Not worth a whole lot. Boring armor? We'll take the probes. Can I rest here? Okay, well, I can't rest until my levitate wears off. Hmm. I don't know which direction I should be heading in. The little chest here. It's locked. What lockpicks have we got? Oh, hey, what am I doing this for? Oh, I don't have enough magicka to cast these. Dang. Are you serious? Well, I'll just wait until my levitate wears off. There we go. Gotcha! Alright. Oh, only six gold. Oh well. Gold is gold, right? Yeah, I really could use some hotkeys. Okay. Anything over here? I don't know what this bubbling stuff is. It's really, really creepy. Is this the way forward here? Whoop. I don't know if I want to proceed yet. I want to continue exploring where we are. Let me go back and look this way. I'm digging this ruin. We haven't we haven't gone through any areas that have been like this before, have we? What do we got? Okay. Alchemical ingredients. I'll take those. Scrolls. Vigor. Spell trap. Red death. Wow, that's nice. Gray death. Lock splitter. I'll take those. Frame rate's going wonky for something. I don't know what's going on there. There we go. Hmm. So we'll swim this way. Let's see what we find. Ooh, found a skelly. Yeah, what the hell is with the frame rate right now? It's he's jumping up and down. Usually it's solid 60 frames per second while we're indoors. Let me save and check on what the hell my computer's doing. Alrighty then. I don't know what that was. Hopefully it won't happen again. Oh, we finally got one with a sword. He wants to come fight us close and personal. I'll lockpick you to death. The block skill increased. God, what the hell's up with the frame rate, dude? Why is it doing that? down to like two frames a second. I don't understand. It was running just fine and then all of a sudden... Pfft. I can't even use the mouse to click on shit because it keeps jumping right past where I want to go. Alright, let me, re let me restart. Alrighty then. Now that's taken care of. We're back. Let's keep having a look around here. You don't have anything for me. Oh, another opponent. Excuse me. Oh. I'm gonna get up close and use my flaming hand. Woo ha 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 ha! These guys don't seem to be able to do much against that. Thought I heard a voice. 
Didn't know skeletons could make sounds like that. What have you got? That's a staff. Silver staff. That's cool. We'll take it. What about you? Dude, these dumber these dunmer mummies are creepy. Seriously. Iron spark cleaver. I don't want it. Dang it, it's doing it again. Why is it doing that? I don't get it. I don't understand. It was working so well, and then all of a sudden it just... <laughs> play. We'll play through it. We'll try and just get past whatever this problem area is. I don't know what it could be. So that looks like a dead end. We'll swim the other way. This is a pretty big ruin. That's not really a ruin, is it? It's just a big cave. The game keeps freezing like every few frames. What the hell? That is so irritating. I don't understand it. I don't get it. Alright, let's use our flashlight again. <laughs> the way that it lights up the caves is really weird. I have to think that's part of the problem. Oh, hello. Rat coming out of the darkness. Why don't I have my sword out anymore? I'm not sure how I took that off. Oh, it's probably from my lockpick. Yeah, what the hell? I can't, I can't even fight properly. Get out of here. Jesus Christ, it's just locking up. Alright, let's go to the next area and see if that fixes it. I've, never, I've not had more, I've not had more one do this yet, but for some reason my computer occasionally just starts doing this to games where it sucks up the frame rate for no reason. Hmm. See another mummy up there. Let's go take a look at him. See if he has anything good for us. <laughs> 